And if you look at her, says little. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Hello again, Skunk here, and today in the Lands of Zankar, episode 72. What are we doing? Well, as you can see behind me, we have just recently put in the yellow dragon. And it's looking quite awesome. But I've got a couple shulker boxes here of work supply stuff, and I need to put it away. And during the... Was it the last episode? Or... I don't remember. Anyway, uh, Z was working on a shulker unloader, so let's go use that. I've never used it before, so this is going to be a learning experience. Uh, he put it in here. Shulker unloader. Shulker boxes. Okay, we'll just throw them in. And it's going to unload it for us. Okay, well then we can take these and put them over here. Because these are all of our empty ones. And let's go see here. Look at that! It's all being sent into the system. Wait, I didn't put that in there. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're going to let that unload, which is great. Uh, however, I'm probably going to need one of these because what we're going to be doing today is heading over to Tenro's place because Tenro has made his giant tower that's reaching up into the sky and he's got his own little level that's his, uh, his well, it's his own level, yeah, where he can keep his stuff and he's like, hey, anyone can take one of the other levels and he's got them all color coordinated for us. I'm red, of course. I mean, look at my sleeve. I, look at me. I'm red. I've got to be red. So we're going to go over there and decorate our little suite. And it will be sweet. <laughs> anyway, so we need to gather up some stuff that says Skunk Punky. And he's already got it, you know, reddish in color. So we need to get some more stuff. So let's let's see. This gift for Skunky, that's got a lot of red things. And I think it would be really cool to display a bunch of... Really? I didn't know he gave me that. Uh, special skunky scoot. I think it would be really cool to display a bunch of these things. I don't know why I've got that over there. And let's see. Did I get anything in the Christmas box that might look good over there? Hmm. A steam gear. No. Just... Yeah. I've got more. I got an extra light show. I didn't even realize. This is an interesting Christmas box. I just realized that. All right, uh, we're gonna leave the Christmas box here, but we're gonna take this because this is very disc of the skunky. Uh huh. <laughs> this is very, very me, and I don't think I want to take any of the rest of this. I might take the naughty. That'd be hilarious. Uh, the logs I put there. Little bunny bites. Uh oh, I need to update this really quickly. <gasps> oh yeah yeah yeah. Let's go do that. Um. Yeah, this is going to be looking really cool. Uh, there we go. Now the yellow dragon is on the map. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, I cannot wait to see all five. Well, sorry, you're not going to be able to see the red dragon once we get it built. Uh, well, once we get it, you'll understand why. But you'll see the other four on there. So let's go stick this here. And now we've got the purple dragon there, the yellow dragon there. We've got to get the blue dragon and the green dragon. And I kind of thinking that this water needs to flow a little bit more and we can have the blue dragon mostly underwater, which would be kind of cool. We might be doing the blue dragon next. I don't know. But this is looking cool. I love how the base is looking. This is going to get a lot more filled. Anyway, we need, to, we need to focus. So we need to get some stuff and get it ready to take over there. So let me go look in my, uh, in my storage area and see what we can find. I've run around like a madman gathering different things. Of course, this is our gift for Skunky Box that we could... You know what? We're just going to keep these. We, we need these things. Let's throw them in here. Uh, yeah. Um, I don't know why I left them in there, but uh, yeah, there we go. So, yeah, these are a lot of different red things. Oh, red nether bricks. Oh, I threw those in. I'm like, whoop. Uh, and we threw the chilkers in here, and we've already got one that's been unloaded, which is awesome. But this is the different things that I've been collecting. So I'm going to have a suit of arm. Oh, I need to get an armor stand for over there, don't I? Yes. Uh, a bunch of the mini blocks to put there. Also dragon heads because I'm into dragons. Yeah. Uh, a red parrot's head, of course. Some other red blocks and item frames to put stuff in. And then a jukebox because, well, we're going to bring over a pig step for ourselves over there. As, you know, we have to. 
And then statues right here, because with this thing, if we look at it, this allows us to item frames, invisible item frame, which is going to look absolutely amazing. You know what? I should do that with all of these. Yeah, I totally should, but not right now. That would take way too much time. So we're going to be taking that. And then right here at this red banner, I've got a special thing that I want to do with that. So uh, let's head to the nether, pick up the pig step, and then head over to Tenrose. Okay, let's grab our pig step to bring over, and then let's see. Is there anything else that we might want to take? Um... <gasps> paintings oh that might be a good idea I like that idea we really need to empty this one out and put it into our smash um yeah that should I think we've got some wool already so let's let's head over to we're gonna make a stop over at the shopping district and then we will what are you doing on there sir uh, then we will head over to ten rows and yeah I've got something to show you at the shopping district and I've also got something to do at the shopping district so I'll meet you over there We've arrived at the shopping district community hub area, and what I want to do is I want to copy these because I want this to be in my, uh, I think, oh, they must have put that there to put that on. Uh, I want this to be in my suite over there, so let's, how do you copy these things? I don't remember. Can, does it have to be in a loom? Crud! Ah! I figured out my issue. I'm an idiot. <laughs> These are black banners. Look, it says black banner right at the top. And it has, yeah, it has a red base, but it's, this is, ugh. all right, so let's just do this. So we need one of those. We need one of those. We need two of those and one of those. All right, now we can go and put these. Actually, let's get rid of this. Now we can go put these in. Back in the shopping district, and I'm just going to keep these because red banners, I'll, I can decorate with that as well. And with the K, we have now put it back. It says skunk. I have all the other letters. Ah, oh, what a dirt moment. Anyway, what I wanted to show you guys over here was, look at this. Isn't this thing absolutely amazing? It's so amazing. This was made by Hava and Jalushko. <laughs> look at little Laflack. He's so cute. I love it. Uh, Tenro's got his T on. Look at me. Yeah, where's my red? Where's my red? And there's a Z with me. And oh, look at everyone. Look, look, little creative kitty. And oh, man, everyone. Good job. Hava and Jalushko, you guys deserve front row here. That is looking amazing. Uh, yes, that is so cool. So now I think we've got everything. Let's head over to Mr. Tenro's, which... Got an idea what to build here. Contact Hava and no tunnels. Okay, that's weird. Um, wait, what's, what are these things over here? I don't recognize what these things are. The Eastern... Oh, it's a miniature version. <laughs> that's so cool. All right, so let's go over to Mr. Denro's base, which is on this line right here. And have I guys, have I ever showed you guys this base? I, I don't know. It, it's right over here. It's not very far away at all. It's amazing. Uh, now that we're not on top of the roof, everything seems so much closer. Yeah, it's just like right over here. And if we continue along that line, it'll take us over to Manga Man. So I kind of need to make something that's going to go from his to uh, mine. And he's I think he's working like an under lava tunnel here for his base to i don't know so much things going on let's just drop this in here and head down the path and it's looking so pretty and fancy and don't come after me piglin i'm not wearing any gold and there's this portal here we are in tenro's tower and if you look here's his little ah, i didn't mean to do that um Let's head back up. Uh, so this is the sweet selector. So this is red. This is me. Uh, so this is blue. This would be his. So if we hop in here, it would take us to his uh, red. There we go. Let's head up to our suite. And it's, why would you leave stuff here, man? This is my area. How dare you? Uh, so this is my area to do with as I please. And then if we walk out here, here we can have... 
like a bedroom or storage and we can head up here this is our own personal landing platform everything's looking so amazing and this is just so cool so now we got to figure out what we're gonna do with it and the first thing I'm gonna do with it is put down my things get rid of his things and then uh, then we're gonna make a plan and start decorating I think I have come up with a good plan so this area is kind of like the entertaining area where people might come up and visit so we're going to put a lot of our decorations here this is where my name's gonna go and stuff like that right over here this is going to become the kitchen prep area where I could keep storage or I can do cooking right up here is going to be my bedroom where I'm going to have a bed placed down, obviously beds placed down, um, and might have a few more decorations in here that are a little bit more, you know, personal just to me. Uh, this will just be a landing platform, so we'll probably just cover this in red carpet so it glows, not glows red, but that it's, it's red and people know who they're landing at. Even though there's red glass, I'd like to have it to be even more red. Oh, there's going to be a lot of red carpet everywhere, let's be serious. Uh, so yeah, I kind of have an idea of how I want to start. So I'm going to start plopping stuff down, and I'll be back with a progress update soon. So I've done a little bit of work, and I wanted to show you guys what it looked like if you pop up out of here. Bam! Has that changed, or has that changed? So we've got our dragons up there. I've got skunk right there. We've got a little fire burning here. And I went with the blue soul flames, because I think they contrasted with the red fairly well. We've got a little bit of seeding around this area. Some rose bushes in the corners, and then I put all the little uh, things that were in the gift on these little item frames. And of course, some of them are names, some of them are not. And yeah, I think this is looking really, really nice. I put a clock over here because you always want to know what time it is. I threw some redstone torches in because, well, I mean, let's face it, they're red. I'm going to put them in. <laughs> so yeah, this is, oh, I also put some of the uh, red mini blocks in. I just, I just love it. It just, it just so much red. <laughs> it is absolutely amazing. And underneath of some of the carpet, I put in some lighting. Not that anything's going to spawn in here anyway, but just to give it that nice glowy feel. And I think this is, uh, this one is done. Now we need to move into the preparatory area or the bedroom. I think we're going to head into the preparation area. And what we're gonna, just going to throw this here. Yeah, I had started adding this. My bedroom is going to be that. Uh, so, yeah, I think some of this... I'm going to put this stuff in the bedroom. But I think we're going to put more like the food items down there. I also need to get a furnace. That'd be a smart idea. Um, yeah, so I'm going to get started on this area here. And I'll be right back. By the way, I can't count the amount of times that I've had to run back to my base to get more materials that I've forgotten. But I wanted to show you guys something. Uh entrancy only and bye thanks for uh and, and that yeah stop it by um up to suite selection current floor entrance lobby up sweet see that's how sweet's supposed to be spelled so this has been months absolutely months since uh steam and i were here for something and yeah i i renamed a bunch of these <laughs> apparently he hasn't noticed in all that time so uh yeah it's pretty funny all right back to work i just realized i forgot to mention these i put up the red banners here to kind of cover the exit and also the rooms and i think that's kind of a nice little touch but let's head in here and i have gotten the crafting cooking area all set up I've got a lot of red going on, of course. I got a little bit of lights from the redstone lamps. And I had the food here and I got rid of the item frames, but it kind of looks like plates, so I left them. Uh, these are salmon heads that are in that are in item frames, but the item frames are hidden. So I think that's kind of a cool little touch. I liked it, because salmon food and actually there's some salmon right there as well. So that is the kitchen all done. I also went ahead and put the carpet up here so you can see the big red skunky landing pad. Now we just need to finish up the bedroom and then our suite is all done. So let's go throw these things. Eh, that's not where to throw them. Let's go throw these things over here where they're out of the way. Actually, I might 
I might do something there. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. So, uh, yeah, let's get started on the bedroom, and then I'll be back with the final look. I decided to change these stairs here just to keep the feeling of this room all the same. And if we go up here, we'll head over to the bedroom. And it is all done. I threw in some red blocks everywhere. I put in these lamps. I love the way that these lamps look. Here is my red parrot head with a little speck of skunky dust. Uh, over here we have pig step all loaded up and a disc of the skunky. And here is some backup armor. Trying to get... Oh, yes, we need that respiration villager indeed. Uh, and then I changed this right here because I needed to get some lighting up in this area. So we have a rug there. Some extra lighting down here. And I think... That is going to do it. I think this is looking absolutely amazing. Oh, oh, also, up here, I put redstone torches around. A little lamp right here because that was a dark spot. And I like those redstone torches because uh, if you fly... That's not going to work. If you fly away and you look at it, those redstone torches really light up that area for... Uh, not for lighting, but for, you know, landing purposes. So... That is going to do it for, hi guys, that is going to do it for today, and if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and consider subscribing, turn on those notifications, you can follow me on Twitter, join my Discord channel, and I'll see you guys in the next Lens of Zankar. Until next time.